now I want to invite our Mayor, Del Sheer, to come and officially open the colourful icons of Cairns. Thank you, Del. Thanks very much, Andrew. And uh, Andrew shares my passion for Cairns and for this region. I know a lot of people in the room do it, so I'm very pleased to be able to be here uh, with, uh, along with some of the other fellow icons of Cairns, um, photographed in ways, Loco, Shelley, um, who else is here? Brian. Uh, yes, Dale, I had to watch you there. Yeah, it's, uh, there's a great, and then Harold, um, a, a great way of sort of capturing um, the, the people and the, and the spirit of this place. So I'm very, very pleased to officially open um, the exhibition. Thank you. I've got to say, folks, you've got no idea how much fun it was taking these shots. <laughs> Like uh, Shelley and I were on one Friday night, and it was just hilarious the, the complexity of it. Steve's got some ox kidneys, ox kidneys that have to be cut up and turned into a look like a brain. <laughs> Shelley's standing in, in the bowling centre with Paul Marshall. Thank goodness he wasn't there to see what was actually going on. Holding up brains with Steve and taking pouring blood over it. Anyone walked in on this, you would just assume it was some kind of satanic ritual. And I'm pretty sure that there was an earthquake or something somewhere in the world that night as a result of it. I'm sitting there with tanniers drawn all over my face and they're rattling with a bookshelf behind me to make the books fall out if you look at these shots. Simon is actually six foot seven according to the shots in here. Locko, we're looking at Locko and we're all concerned about what happens when you put a coin in the slot. In all ways of one, Dales and, and the whole shot out the front of the coca with the with the, with the jelly babies falling over. We want to know, Dales, if you've got your jelly baby. We always get our jelly baby. You always get your jelly baby. <laughs> <laughs> I just I just love it. It was a, it was so much fun to do those kind of shoots and again need to do more of that kind of stuff in this town. We need to be, you know, if people do these things, we need to support them, we need to get behind them, we need to tell everyone about it because the more aware people are, the more we can do them and it makes this town really so much more colourful. And I've got to do, I would like to invite Mr Rutherford to come up and say nice things. <laughs> well, thank you very much guys. Um, I hope you're having a good time so far. Um, uh, this has been um, something that I call baggage for this project. Um, I carry a bag everywhere and in, in, in it are uh, my beliefs, my ambitions and my goals. And this is one very big step towards a very big goal that I'm looking to achieve in life. So what you're looking at is a culmination of about two and a half months of work, not just photographs but uh, 2 a.m. Photoshop work. And, Cyclone Larry type thoughts. <laughs> so it was, a, it was a great deal of fun, uh, a hell of a lot of work, but uh, if, if you've had a good look around so far, then you'll see the fruits of my labour, you might say. <laughs> but um, I do want to thank a few people, and that is mainly the subjects that have allowed me to draw on their faces and throw books at them and make them hold ox kidneys with blood and all sorts of things. So um, thank you very, very much. Like our I represent you OK. I think that's your weekend jobs. I'm very happy to be here. You already are, mate, so thank you. <laughs> um, to everybody, thank you very, very much for your support, all the sponsors, uh, all the, uh, the setting that we have here from Taboo, and all the different products, the, the framing, the printing, to everything that's been put together to, to help this come to fruition. And the response from everybody in Cairns is unbelievable. Uh, what do you think? In, all of the months that I was preparing this, I was going to get this sort of response, especially from the media as well. So it's, uh, it's been fantastic and I'm very, very proud of this all. Very proud to be part of Festival Cairns, I should say Cairns Festival, that's not correct. So, <laughs> it's wrapped over the wrist a few times for that. Um, but um, I am very, very proud to put this on. I hope you guys have a good time. If you have any questions, come and pick my brain. I'm sure there's going to be plenty of the public's going to do that for the next four weeks. So um, thank you very, very much. One last thank you, I have to thank my beautiful wife. Because without her eight weeks running sheet, I would not know where I am. Um, also, one other quick uh, thank you, Stacy. Where are you? Put your hands up. Stacy. Stacy's our new employee. She's been brought in to um, sort me out because my. <laughs> My administration has dropped in the last few months because of this project. So, uh, see, thank you very much, Stacey. You've made a world of difference. So, um, I'll leave.
leave it at that. Thank you very, very much. Andrew, thank you very much for, for addressing everybody tonight and uh, helping out. Mayor Val, thank you very much for opening this officially. And uh, also, Dennis and Aaron. Can't miss you, mate. You're right up back there. <laughs> thank you very much. That was a big project and that was a, that was an integral part of it. So thank you very, very much. Much appreciated. Enjoy the rest.